Hello, this video will show you how to connect and run a generator for the first time Spooky2 users. The first part is to show you how to install Spooky2 software. Please download the installer on https colon dash dash www.spooky2.com dash downloads page dash there are two options, Spooky2 Starter Pack and Spooky2 15th July 2020 Full Installer. As a Spooky2 new user, we recommend you download Spooky2 Starter Pack that contains the latest Spooky2 Full Installer software, the Spooky2 User's Guide, the Spooky2 Quick Guide, and the Spooky2 Resources Directory we can left click to download it. After the download completes, you need to double click spooky2 underscore setup underscore 20200715 exe to unzip it and extract files. When it asks choose a language, you can choose the one you need. Click the next button. Tick yes, I accept the terms of the license agreement. Please tick DH experimental presets and Newport presets if you need them. Then click the next button. Please click yes when it asks save previous spooky installation and wait. It will take a few minutes to copy files. After setup complete, please tick the yes and click the finish button to launch the program file. If it is the first time to install the Spooky2 software, please choose yes to install the driver. Then click Next and tick I accept the agreement. Now the driver is installed successfully. The second part is to show you how to connect Spooky2 XM Generator, Spooky2 Remote 2.0 and Spooky2 Boost 3.1. These two are the USB cable and power adapter of the generator. This is Spooky2 XM generator. This is Spooky2 Boost and this is Spooky2 Remote. This is the paper sticker for your fingernail. First, we connect the power adapter. Then, we connect the generator to the computer using the USB cable. Now, we connect Spooky to Boost. The Boost should be connected to the OUT1 and OUT2 of the generator. Please twist to lock the port. Now we connect a Spooky2 remote to the BN port of the Spooky2 Boost. We also need to twist to lock the port. Then we'll show you how to put your fingernail into the remote. First, we need to split the sticker, then put our fingernail on it. 
and use another sticker to cover it. Then we can write our names on the sticker and put it into the remote. After the connection is complete, we can turn on the generator. The last part is to show you how to operate Spooky2 software. Please double click the Spooky2 icon to start Spooky2 software. It will take a few minutes to load the database. On the control tab, there is a square button that has the number 3. It means that Spooky2 software found the Spooky2 XM generator. Before the first treatment, it is better to run the terrain protocol which is an essential step. So we choose detox, remote, terrain, bracket R close bracket BY. Then we go to the control tab, tick overwrite generator and click the generator button. Finally, Click the start button. The generator becomes green and it means the program is running.